it's crazy see where chicho the sad part is that most people in america agree with vaccine mandate they're afraid of unvaccinated folks now well majority of people in america in the united states and canada and western world have been indoctrinated through centralized education if you want to call it that schooling no wonder in 2001 after 9 11 85 plus percent of the population in the united states and canada supported the invasion and occupation of afghanistan well they were stupid weren't they what a bunch of dumbasses you know why i'm saying that because i was arguing with them back then that those morons that supported going to war were going to be wrong right oh chicho they were saying 21 years ago come on you can't say that these people are terrorists these people are this well 21 years later it comes out that no chicho and a handful of people i went the first protest peace rally i went to against the invasion of afghanistan they hadn't even gone in yet right against the invasion of afghanistan was in a pouring rain in front of the art gallery in vancouver british columbia there was about 30 of us right 75 percent were women there were the raging grannies there okay that's when i grew my respect for the raging grannies went through the roof right raging grannies were protesting women were protesting and there was like five men me being one of them five or six men right maybe it was 50 i don't know five six less than 10 men rest everybody women right 50 of us were the first rally i went to peace protests i went to in a pouring rain in vancouver demonstrating against the invasion of afghanistan back then people said i was out of my mind i was wrong it took 21 years for people to realize that that was a biggest fuck up that was the empire killer destroyed the united states empire right how many years do you think it's going to take for people to go to realize that maybe it wasn't a good idea to force people to take a shot from pharmaceutical companies that have throughout the decades been fined billions of dollars for peddling poison to humanity right all of them Johnson & Johnson Pfizer all of them all of them all of them billions of dollars in fines for selling uh, drugs that they knew were tainted because they needed to unload those drugs right or they suppressed clinical trial data right because they put a lot of money into it because they needed to increase shareholder value on Wall Street how long do you think it's going to take for us that have stood against this kind of centralized power control right to be proven right how many times does this have to happen for the general population to wake the f up and go hey maybe we shouldn't trust our governments right how many of those people in europe right now that are being flooded by migrants and refugees in the united states actually blame their own governments for destroying those nations when are people going to wake the f up right there has to be a stand right you can't give in to fear and fear is what centralized power peddles